Welcome to the e-requisition demo. Let's talk about what e-requisition is. E-requisition is a purchase order approval system that integrates with your QuickBooks. First, a requisition is created and then it is submitted for approval. Once all approvals have been completed, then the requisition is converted into a purchase order and the PO is then synced into QuickBooks. Now let's log in as a requester and create a requisition. To ultimately create a PO in your QuickBooks, eRequisition must utilize the data coming from your QuickBooks. Starting from the top of the requisition, select the vendor, enter the rest of the requisition detail information at the top, and then select the items that you'd like to purchase. All the items used are coming from the item list in your QuickBooks. requisition has now been created and we can submit it for approval. Now let's log in as the approver and approve the requisition. We are now logged in as the approver. Locate your requisition and open it. Upon opening the requisition you'll notice the screen is the exact same as the requester's screen. The only difference being is there's a few more buttons at the bottom. Those buttons allow you to approve or reject the requisition. You'll notice the button in the bottom right corner is Create PO. Create PO means that you're the final person in this approval workflow and you will now convert this requisition to a purchase order. Once the PO has been converted, it will assign it a PO number and then it will queue it to sync with QuickBooks. We have now moved over to the e-requisition history screen. You can see all of your requisition and purchase order history from your history screen. You can see here is our PO at the top with the number assigned. You can see the status is pending sync. That means that it has not synced into QuickBooks yet. However, it is available for use. From this screen, you can email the PO or print it. Now let's discuss the syncing. The syncing tool can be installed wherever your QuickBooks is sitting. The sync can be set to run manually whenever you press the button, as we've done here, or it can be set to run on frequency. So you can have the sync set to run every 30 minutes, one hour, once a day, whatever you prefer. Our PO is now successfully synced to QuickBooks. Let's open it up. Select purchase orders, and there's our PO. Thank you for watching.